Raindrops. Um, sorry. To find the number of flats at the key signature from the tonic of the scale, or to find the key of the scale from the number of flats, there's one simple rule to follow. Oh, that is not the rule. Um, <clears throat> the name of the tonic. of the major flat scale is always <clears throat> the second to last flat at the key signature. Okay. Therefore, if you're looking for the number of flats in the major scale of, let's say, D flat, you would, for example, consult your circle of fifths and find all the flats leading up to D flat, which is the tonic, and adding the next flat to follow. Um, so let me show you a. Uh, all the uh, let me show you all the flats that belong to the major scale of D flat. Right, so all these flats belong to the major scale of D flat. Um, therefore, the major scale would be uh, what is that? B flat, E flat. <coughs> Excuse me, A flat. D flat and the next one is G flat right if you have a number of flats and you're looking for the tonic you proceed in the complete opposite direction right for example um, let me give you a <clears throat> the um, three flats at the key signature. So these three flats here, right, would be B flat again. Uh, what is that? E flat and A flat. Okay, again, the name of the tonic of the major flat scale is always the second to last flat at the key signature. Therefore, bum ba -da bum the tonic would be E flat major. So this Z sky right here is E flat. Okay. Um, so if you want to just jot down the notes of the scale, the notes of the scale would be uh, E flat, F, G, A flat, B flat, C, um, D flat, and back up to E flat, the octave. Right. To find the composition of all the other major scales with flats, you always use the same model. However, you've already mentioned that the scale of the F major is the exception. Its key signature has only one flat, so how can you use the model? You cannot use the model for the scale, you just have to know that the scale of F major has only one flat which is B flat. So let me um, post the, uh, the uh, major scales with flats and uh, we'll reference them out. Okay. So here we go. So um, this one would be again like, I, like, like we just said uh, the, the B flat um, what would correspond to the scale of F major. Okay. This one B flat, right? Major. The next one would be E flat major. Ooh. Uh next one is A flat major. 
then D flat major. I think we just saw that up here, right? Then G flat major. And the, the, the last one would be C flat major. All right. Um, you're, uh, generally, you're encouraged to learn the key signature for the flat keys by memory, but if you have any difficulty, just refer to the method that we described above.